Now we should have good weather for the race and that will be welcome news for the teams. And here we have the Alfa Romeo. They're in the front half of the pack, so there's plenty of potential for them. And it's the second Alfa Romeo there. A top 10 position today, but will they be able to capitalize on it? Will their hard work pay off today? One of the newest races in F1, and hopefully one of the most exciting too. It's the Miami Grand Prix. And it's lights out, and away we go. Let's go. So let's focus on the, on the race now. Looks like Aston Martin have just gained the race position. We need to get these tyres to last. Who's running wide there? Oh, and that's a crash! We can take a look now. Okay, here's the Ferrari. There's the crash.
out. Let's see what happened there. Now let's watch this. The Alfa Romeo involved in this one. Thank goodness nobody else was involved. That. We've just had a crash on the track. Here's the replay. Okay, so there we have the Alpine. And that's an off, and a big off. Red Bull gained a place.
There's been a crash. Sounds like a single car. Let's have a look. Now we see the Williams here. Dear me, they won't have been expecting that. Upper place. You're good to push. Check it flat. Fantastic work from the Alfa Romeo driver. Really great finish there for Alfa Romeo. This was thrilling to watch. They've done an excellent job and they deserve all the plaudits. And they're in sixth place in the constructor standings at the end of this weekend. Formula One will be back to Europe for the next round on the shores of the Mediterranean with some heated competition to look forward to in Spain. <laughs>